In this video, we're going to be showing you three drills to help improve your run. A lot of the time, kids don't know where to put their arms, what to do with their feet, how to get build up better speed, um, which muscles to use. So in this one, it's going to be three easy drills to show how to make you be able to run faster and hopefully not trip over yourself and not trip as much either. So Brigham's going to help me with these. So on drill number one, you're going to start in a pipe position. So legs super tight, you're pointing your feet, not just your toes, but your whole foot through your toes. You're gonna be sitting up really super tall and your chin is gonna be up and your arms are gonna be strong to the sides. And then we're going to switch them off. So hands are flat like, are flat and arms are trying to be 90 degree angles. So we're gonna go, this is one and switch two. Remember, sit up tall, chin up, and three. Good job, and four. Strong, strong arms, and five. Good, and six. Try to get it a little bit faster, because when you're running, you're trying to move your arms really fast. Seven, and eight. Good job, Brigham. Okay, so drill number two, we're going to use um, a mat. So you could use stairs, you could use a curb, you could use anything that will give you the level difference. So go ahead and stand up, Brigham. Okay, so you want to make sure your strong muscles, that your feet are facing forward, okay, not turned out. Your knee is strong and it's facing forward over your toes, okay? Well. <laughs> and then your back leg starts straight, your front leg starts bent. You use opposite arms, so opposite strong arms, looking forward. So well, this is one. So 90 degree angles, chin forward, trying to pull this elbow back without moving your hips. Don't break your box. Knee over your foot. Okay, and then we're gonna switch to two. Go ahead and switch two. Strong, strong, strong. Remember, switch your arms. Switch your arms. Good job. And you want a 90 degree angle, pointing your foot. Don't try, try not to lean back or forward. You're trying to hold still and strong. Good job, go back to one. Strong, switch. Make sure you're switching those arms, okay? Ready, and try again, up two. Good job, and down, one. Good job, and you wanna practice that on both of your feet. Okay, and now we're gonna move on to drill number three. Okay, ready, Brigham? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me move this mat. Okay. Okay, so come over here, stand up tall. Okay, so you're gonna go here. Hands on your hips, so you're not worrying about your arms on this drill. We're just worrying about pushing through the ball of your foot, bringing up your knee, making sure your chin stays up so you're not falling, and so we don't need to worry about our arms too. That would be, let's just work on our legs on this one, okay? So start, tummy in tight, arms, shoulders down while lifting up tall. Pretend that there's a rope pulling up to the ceiling, but with keeping your shoulders down. There you go, good job. Okay, so we're gonna start and on number one, we're gonna put whatever leg you want in front first and go to a lunge. So one, put it down, bend that leg. So this leg stays straight, good. Okay, and as you pick up your foot, your back foot is gonna go pull it up and you're gonna push through the ball of your foot and then you're gonna pull it up in front of you to up to your, good. This is two, good. And then point your foot, remember, Good job. And then you're gonna put that down and go three. Good. Push through that ball of your foot. Back leg is straight. Ball of your foot, good job. Knee, make sure it stays straight. Nope. Knee, make sure your foot stays straight and your knee stays over your foot. Your foot should be straight, not turned out or in. Good job. Three and then four. Good job. And five, put it down in front. Make sure it's bent. Now, he's kind of moving his hips a little bit and moving his knees so they're not over his feet. So just make sure that they're straight forward and then step together. And then just practice that as many times as you want to make sure that you're practicing all those techniques within that drill. So this is Brigham running before the drill. And this is Brigham running after we practice the drill multiple times. will hopefully make you run a little bit faster. 
very fast. 